Hi, it's Jim Empey for Livestrong.com. I'm here at Quail Hollow Golf Club in Boise, Idaho. And the reason I'm here today is to talk about how to get to a solid impact position where the club's able to compress the ball and get it to launch with spin. I get asked quite often from players who feel like the club flips at impact, where they feel like the club head flips ahead of their hands and arms. And I get asked quite often how to stop that. And let me answer that question in a couple of ways. One is, if we're gonna get the club to release in a timely fashion, so that at impact, we've got a slight forward lean to the shaft of the club, to do that, we've gotta have a lower body that unwinds and moves dynamically to the left side. If our lower body stalls or is stationary, the club's gonna to tend to release early and flip through impact. And that sort of um, ineffective release produces thin shots, it produces heavy shots, it doesn't compress the ball and get it to launch with any sort of energy. The second thing we're going to do to produce a solid impact is we're going to uh, remember that we've got to allow the club to unhinge and release with the motion of the swing, not with our efforts to produce a solid hit. In other words, as we swing forward and as the club unwinds and comes forward into impact, we've got to allow gravity and centrifugal force to unhinge it, to release the wrist hinge, rather than us doing it manually with any sort of hand action. If we can learn to swing through and allow gravity to work for us, the club begins to release in a consistent way and we're able to hit solid shots in a routine way. Good luck with that. <music>